quick little trigger warnings for Blackwell Legacy on the side there. So look over them if you have any questions. Um, hope everybody's doing good this Monday. Good, had a good start to the week. Um, mine was okay, I guess. It's pretty normal. Um, woke up early as hell, went to work, was late to work because traffic sucks. You know, typical corporate America shit. You feel? Um, I'm going to be playing, like I said, Blackwell Legacy some more. So we're going to do some point and click ghosty mystery stuff. Um, and yeah, I'm, I'm excited to, I'm excited to play some more of this. I was thinking about it this weekend and I was like, man, I was actually having a pretty good time. Like I'm I obviously haven't gotten very far in it and, you know, haven't like had to really solve very many puzzles, but from what I did see, I did like it. So it's very up my alley. I'm itching for a good, uh, good mystery, um, in a way that Ace Attorney doesn't provide, because Ace Attorney usually provides it for me, um, but also I wanted something a little more gameplay than Steins Gate, which got some good, good things in the works, I guess, uh, but yeah, I'm gonna be playing that in a minute, I'm just gonna give this little trigger warning another, another little couple, couple seconds, um, just cause our dealing with death, violence, you know, murder, and, uh, things like that. Um, yeah, I don't really have much to say. <laughs> it's been kind of, it's been, it's been a day. It's been a normal, a normal Monday for me. So, um, hopefully you guys will, uh, enjoy. <laughs> All right. I will hop on over. I'm going to turn this off for us. Nope. That's Steins Gate. Boop. Bam. All right. Now let's get Blackwell Legacy up and running. Um, we're gonna be Rosangela. I think we just call her Rosa. Oh God, where'd it go? Hello, Blackwell Legacy, anyone? Yes, are you there? Hello? <laughs> there we go. That's, that's what I want. All right, so when we left off, I believe we were about to talk to, uh, can y'all hear it? Yes, there we go, there we go. Uh, so Rosangela here apparently is haunted. Our family has like a, I guess either one of these is fine. Um, can I load this one? Options? Uh. Hmm. I'm hitting load game and it's Restore? Oh! See, that's misleading, because I feel like if you click restore, I thought that implied that it, like, erased it, because that's usually what happens when you hit restore on a computer. I got scared. Alright, um, so, let me... That leads to my bedroom. It's an oversized closet, but it suits me fine. I forgot that this is fully voice acted. Um, I gotta get my buttons back. Um, inventory. I? No. F? T? E S A S <laughs> I forgot how to open my inventory. Is it just up at the top? I guess it is just up at the top. Uh notes. Uh Nope. Girls in the photo. Kelly? Kelly gave me the photograph in the first place. I probably should return it to her. Okay. Girls in the photo, Joanne. Two of the three girls in the photograph are dead. I wonder about the third. Oh, that's creepy. According to Kelly, Joanne is the girl in the middle. I wonder who the others are. Uh, Adrian Kelly. Adrian lives a few doors down from Joanne in the NYU dorm. He's the resident assistant for the floor. Right. Okay. Right. Kelly was that, the goth girl, I believe. Okay, uh, Joey. Joey. Yeah? Joey's my ghost friend. 
Um, oh, I think we already talked about that. History? Auntie. What was Auntie Lauren like? What do you want to know about her for? I just do. Can't you tell me anything? Hey, we've got lots to do. Ask me later. What about Grandma? What was my grandmother like? Her? We have to talk about her? What's wrong with her? Nothing. Forget it. Ask me later. Okay. Uh, I'll ask about Joey. Ask Joey to stop moving. Ask Joey to leave. Um, I think I'm going to ask him about How death. did you die? Excuse me? How did I die? Yeah. That's a bit of a personal question, isn't it? Is it? Yes. Sorry. Damn. Uh, ghostly powers? So what can you actually do? Do? As a ghost. Any powers or anything like that? What you see is what you get, dear. I can float through walls as long as I'm still near you. But you can't touch anything. Not really. Not really? Well, you remember that breeze you felt when I manifested myself last manifested. night? Manifested, yeah. That's the extent of my physical presence. Oh, they're walking. Neat trick, huh? Not really. <laughs> Not <was> really. <laughs> no. I guess I have nothing I think left I've to heard say. Enough. So, yeah, let's get going. All right, where are we supposed to be going? I guess we'll go back and give her a... Uh... You coming? Yeah, sure. Well, it's not like he can... It, he just said that he couldn't be too far away from her. I don't know why. Wait, I should go visit... Um, what's her name? Nishanti. That door leads to Nishanti's apartment. Can I go? Come in. Nashanti, she's home. And now Joey's with me. Welcome back, Rosa. Come in. Uh -huh. Are you all right, Rosa? You look a little preoccupied. I'm I think fine. she knows. I feel like she's spiritual. That's odd. Moti never acts like that. Oh, jeez. In case you haven't noticed, some animals can sense me. Are you getting a good look, Mutt? Boo! <laughs> don't call him a- Oh, don't scare the dog! Aww. What's gotten into you, Moti? I'm sorry, he must be sick or something. No. It's alright. Joey, what the hell? Why are you such an asshole to the dog? There's nothing to be afraid of, I hope. I hope. See ya. Um, you said yesterday that you sense things. Yes. Could you tell me more about that? Yeah. Well, I'm not psychic or anything, if that's what you mean. Ah, oh, damn. I'm just observant. I'm observant. Anyone could tell something was wrong if they kept their eyes open. Speaking of which, care to tell me what's wrong? What do you mean? You look ill at ease, uncomfortable. The way your eyes keep moving back and forth. Is everything all right? Say you're fine, kid. I'm fine. Yep. Everything's just dandy. That's weird. Just dandy. And could you stop looking at me? I mean, I know it's hard. I see. Well, I'm here if you need me. Uh, I don't think I need well, to feed the dog again. Go. He already Take had care, a lot Rosa. of treats, too. Come back whenever you'd like. Um... Can I take a gander in her kitchen? Moti's following me. What a cute pooch. Look at him. Oh, what did I do? Oh. Someone wants a treat, eh? Go get it. Aw. Precious. Um, I don't think I really need to do anything in here. Unless I can look at stuff? Can I look at I can't look at stuff. Joey! Jo Shh! You want to start a riot? Keep your yap shut until we're alone. Awkward. All right, we'll leave. Bye. Bye, Nishanti. I guess we don't say bye. So, dogs can see you, huh? Dogs, cats, birds, any dumb animal. So what does dumb. that make me? I don't know. A gerbil? You kind of look like a gerbil. Shut up. Rude. I'm not knocking on some stranger's door. Why not? Isn't that what point-and-click games are about? Knocking on everybody's door and picking up everything that's not nailed to the ground? I mean, I feel like that's kind of how you do that. Um, 
Well, damn. I guess we'll go back to the the hall with the. The sign reads Sarah Kaplan and Julie Gilberg. This is Adrian's door. Mm -hmm. Hi, it's me again. You have more questions, that I imagine? creepy smile yeah. she does. Is that okay? I suppose so. What do you want to know? Do you recognize the girls in this photo? Yeah. Hmm. Well, that's Joanne. They're on the left. And the other two? I definitely recognize them. They were friends of Joanne. They were up here all the time, but I never spoke to them. Uh, okay. Well, that's all for now. Thanks for helping I guess out. we talked to him Just about everything else, Just so. my name out of it. Right, he wanted to be anonymous. The sign says, Sandy Chen and Sonata Munier. What a name, Sonata Munier. That's The sign fancy. reads, Amanda Fay and Karen Schreier. Ugh, Amanda Fay is really pretty. The sign says, Kelly Hawthorne and Joanne Sherman. The sign says, Shelley Chenoy and Sarah Elmale. Hey, it's open. After you. I guess we're going in. Oh, cool. Yeah. Uh, wow. She's covered her wall with rock posters. There's a notebook on Joanne's desk. It's just a telephone. What about the bulletin board? Now we can snoop. Let's snoop around. That's her, the ghost in the park. She looks so happy here. I wonder what happened to make her like that. Oh. The future Mrs. Davenport? I wonder what that means. I recognize her. That's Joanne. I recognize her. That's Joanne. Okay. So. Can I? No. Joanne and I might not have been buddies, but I'll be damned if I'm going to let some stranger pop through her stuff. Damn, so I got a distractor. The safety bars on the window prevent me from opening it. I'm not getting into Kelly's bed. She hates me enough already. Yeah. It's the only bed in the room. I guess Kelly got rid of the other bed after Joanne left. I don't know why that one was suddenly quieter. Is that creepy doll on the top? I'm not taking Kelly's things. Damn. Man, Joey sure is snooping around, isn't he? She's covered her- No, Kelly, I wanna talk to you. Could I ask you some follow-up questions, Kelly? <sighs> Fine. Make it quick. Okay. Uh... How are you holding up? I'm fine. Midterms are a bitch, but I'm handling it. Aren't or they I always? I would be handling it if you didn't keep bugging me. Thanks again for lending me that photograph. No big deal. It was just sitting there on her desk. Can I take a look around? What for? Just to see if I can find anything else about Joanne. What? You're a detective now? Well, forget it. Could you tell me about the other two girls? Tell me the about photo? these girls, because oh. I need to know. Them. Them? You know them. Oh. Only through Joanne. Do you know their names? Blonde girl is Allie. And the Asian girl, she's Susan. Tried to avoid them when they were here. Really? Why? Yeah. Look, I need my space. Joanne needed her friends around her. So whenever Joanne turned this place into Social Central, I had to split. They didn't care for me, and I didn't much care for them. Well, that was, uh... Do you know anything about Joanne's friend, Allie? Yeah. You mean Miss Blondie? Yeah. I know enough, which isn't much. She was over here all the time visiting Joanne. She was kind of sweet, I guess. Laughed all the time. Ugh, oh, that was annoying. That was usually my cue to get out of here. What do you want to know about her? I'm having difficulty finding her. Would you know where she is? I don't know. She could be anywhere. Studying? Partying? Pushing up daisies. Shh. Huh? Nothing. Right. What about Davenport? Do you know anyone named Davenport? Davenport? No, but it's a stupid name. It's written right over here on Joanne's bulletin board. You think I care what she does? I mean, what she did? I mean, I don't know anyone with that name. Sorry. Mm, she's full of shit. I think she's lying. I think she's lying. Can you tell me anything about Adrian? The RA? He's okay. He helps us wait. 
Uh, we went through that last Thanks time. for helping out. Okay. Yeah, sure. Whatever. All right. Um, Please let me look around. It would really help me out. I've helped you out enough. You can ask your stupid questions, but you touch nothing. Thanks again, Kelly. Okay, very, very forceful about that. Now I think I should do... Notes? No, that's an envelope. Nope, that's not what I wanted. Nope, don't need it. Oop, put it away. Notes. Um. Judging from the photo Kelly gave me, Susan and Allie were close friends. Right. Maybe Allie knows who Davenport is. The name Mrs. Davenport was written under a picture of Susan. Susan was one of Joanne's friends. Yes. So was Allie, I suppose? Allie was one of Joanne's friends. Yep. And just like Joanne, Allie is dead. Allie is dead, just like Joanne. Is there more to this than a simple case of teen suicide? Teen? They're in college. I mean, I guess 18, 19 is college, but really? I get the impression that Kelly didn't care much for Allie. I get the impression that Kelly didn't care much for Susan. Why? Because she said literally, I don't care much for them and they didn't care much for me. <laughs> is that why you got the impression? Uh, hmm. No, I don't see any connection. Can I... Could I ask you some follow-up questions, Kelly? <sighs> Fine. Make it quick. Okay. I don't suppose you'd know anything about Susan. Not much. Quiet, I guess. Maybe she just didn't talk around me. I never stuck around long enough to get to know her. Do you know anyone? No, but it's just... It's okay, I mean, so I mean, she's not so... gonna know anything. Okay, cool. So let's go Thanks talk for help. Yeah, to sure. Adrian again. Thanks again. Whatever. Bye bye now. It's just a telephone. There's a notebook on Joanne. Can I use your phone? What? It'll only take a second. Can I use Fine, phone? fine. Just hurry up. Who do you think you're calling? Uh... Hello, could I speak to Joey, please? <laughs> Hi, Joey? Um... Yes, I had some questions for you. Ah! <laughs> not bad, kid, not yeah, bad. If you got something to say, say it quick. Lady Pincushion here is starting to look a little hot under the collar. Um, I'm gonna ask for advice. Yes, hello. Could you tell me what I'm supposed to do now, please? Do. Look around. Check for clues. We need all the information we can get our hands on. Uh, Joey, I'm not sure I can do what you ask me to do. This is stupid. Kid, you have to. Don't back out now. Joey, can you do something about that little bird who is watching me? Huh? You mean Metal Nose? Metal yes, knows. she's making me nervous. Me? What can I do? You performed a little trick for me earlier. I'd like you to repeat it for me. Trick? Joey, do you see the pile of papers on the desk? Yeah. I need you to work your magic on them. Oh, okay, so then this will give us a distraction. And then we sure, can- Sure, sure, I can handle that. We can rip the notebook off the Thanks desk. Thanks again, Kelly. Yeah, sure. She's like, well, that was weird. Nice one. Yeah, my now beach. We got the notebook. We got the notebook. Okay, uh, can I exit? I still. You committed your first burglary. Woo! We did it! Our did? first burglary! For the greater good, kid. For the greater good. That makes me feel so much better. Moral ambiguity. <laughs> uh, oh God, where is Adrian? Is, is it... No, wait, that's not. There's nobody Shit. home. I didn't mean to click on that. All right, RA's door. Adrian, I got some questions for you, sir. Hmm? Hi, I it's me again. I got some questions for you. You have more questions, I imagine? Yeah. I suppose, what do you mean? Susan. Did you ever meet Joanne's friend, Susan? The name doesn't ring a bell, I'm afraid. What about Allie? Do you know anything about Joanne's friend, Allie? I'm afraid not. Who is Allie? She's, never mind, it's not important. Okay. All right. Uh, Davenport. Thanks, anyway. Davenport? No. Nobody named Davenport on this floor. Thanks, anyway. Okay, so he isn't no shit. 
Well, that's all. Thanks for help. Just remember, we need to eat. Okay, well, I'm gonna take a look at that journal, because... Uh, shit, how do I... I guess it's the right click. Looks like standard poli -sci lecture notes. It looks like Joanne liked to doodle in class. Same. The last set of notes in this notebook are pretty... strange. I'd better take a closer look. Yes, let us take a closer look. Uh, the doodle. Joanne and- oh, something is scratched out. Susan and Alexander. So many men, so little- t What the hell? That's so weird. Oh, I guess Joanne had a breakout. Okay. Message. Can't hear the professor. I no longer care. He won't leave me alone. Can't concentrate. Allison is gone. He made her go. Susan is gone too. They won't let me see her. I am the only one left. I have to hold on. What do you want? What do you want? Oh gosh. It's pretty sus. Pretty sus. Looks like Stan. Um, it looks the left. I'd bet. All right. Um. Actually, wait. No, I didn't mean to click on the door. I meant There's to just no move over there. Um. Alexander. This name was written underneath the picture Joanne drew in her notebook. Adrian, while I'm over here, do you know an Alexander? You didn't know a Davenport, you barely knew Allie and Susan, so... Mm -hmm. Hi, it's me again. You have a <laughs> creepy questions, smile. I imagine? <laughs> yeah, is that okay? You know, her smile looks so. like that new filter on TikTok that? that's like, that makes you grin no matter what face that you're making. Which also, in and of itself, is like, creepy as hell, but... That's what her smile looks like, and that's really sad. All right. Do you know anyone named Alexander? As I said, I know several. You're going to have to give me a last name. Ah, shit. Well, that's all. For Thanks for help. Just remember. Alexander Davenport? Hmm. I think it's safe to say that these refer to the same person. Joanne's friend Susan has some connection with a guy named Alexander Davenport. Whoever Alexander Davenport is, Susan must like him a lot. I He's either a boyfriend or something close to it. Okay, well, I needed a last name, but I have a last name now, so... Mm -hmm. Hi, it's me. You have more questions? I, I swear imagine. it's that gritting yeah. filter. What do you want... Do you know an Alexander Davenport? The name doesn't ring a bell, I'm afraid. Uh, okay, oh, that was useless. Cool, bye. <laughs> Kelly, I know you're working on your midterms, but can I get some help again? Yeah, open. After you. Yeah. Well, Kelly? K Kel Bell? Kellers, uh, other nicknames for Kelly. <laughs> um, I need to talk to you. Could I ask you some follow-up questions, Kelly? <sighs> Fine. Make it quick. I'm gonna question her about Alexander Davenport. Do you know Davenport. Alexander Davenport? No. Okay, well that was useless. Um, thanks for helping. Yes, yeah, sure. Can I? Thanks again. Whatever. Show her the message. No, I can't. Damn it. Looks like Stan, it looks the left side. How do I combine items again? I forgot. This is, why do I have this? This is mine. Joey crashes yet another photograph. Oh. Crashes yet another photograph. Okay. He doesn't look happy. He doesn't look happy. So. Hmm. I'm not getting. Joey. Jo Shh. Don't want to no. keep. Okay. Um. Wish I could show her the doodle. So many men, so little time. Maybe. 
maybe I have to leave. Maybe this isn't the right even place. Joke. Shall we go someplace where you don't look like a crazy homeless person? Uh, okay, I guess. I'm just gonna leave. I'm not stealing. Can just I look a bunch at of it? Notice no. Okay. Can I pull the fire alarm? Looks like a fire alarm. Um, no. Damn it. Alright. Let's go back to the park. I wonder if we could talk to, uh, Madame Phantom. Oh, there she is. No, that's not, not the exit. That's creepy, though. You can see her floating in the background, though. I don't want to, but I guess we should talk to the ghost again. Yeah. Don't worry. I'll do the talking. Yeah, now we've got, like, something of a name, so... Hey there. Remember me? No. Maybe. Um... Is your name Allie? Yes, that's me. Allie Montego is throwing in some excuses of boys, but not so long. Cute. Well, okay. Allie Montego. At least we've confirmed who you are. Allie Montego. Um. Can you tell me about your friend Susan? Quiet Sue. Little Lady Lee. Always neat and always fair. Won't say much, but you'll know she's there. Lady. So Lee? Susan Lee is probably her name. Go away, stupid Deacon. Sending away all my friends. Even the little, little ones. Deacon. Do you know anyone named Alexander Davenport? On a date with Alexander the Great. Was it an accident, or was it just fate? There's a Midna here to say hello. Crawling all over the desk. Where will she go? <laughs> I wanted to keep the rhymes going. Hmm. Little snuggle bug. What are you doing? Can you say hi to everybody? You're shedding everywhere. Oh my goodness. Alright, what is this? Uh, are you friends Joanne? with a girl named Joanne? 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 Beware of Joanne when her plans unfurled. For she intends to take over the world. She had to go away. He drove her away. She didn't understand. Do you know why Joanne killed herself? Joanne? She can't be dead. She's going to change the world. She's not dead. Even though she had to go away. They all had to go away. Because of the deacon. The de okay, she keeps mentioning the deacon. What about Kelly? Do you know Kelly? Kelly, Kelly, crazy Kelly, made of ice jelly. We all drove her away. But that was okay. It wasn't the deacon's fault. It was hers. How about Adrian? Do you know him? Adrian? Adrian the man. The man with the plan. That was very not helpful. Can you tell me who the deacon is? The deacon is the deacon. We called him and he came. He got into my head. He's scared. He's diseased. He's made me diseased too. Now everyone goes away. Oh boy. Hmm. Look, just sit tight. We'll figure this out. And we'll be back. That place is creepy. What? You don't like dogs? You know what I mean. <laughs> um. Oh, it's so weird I can see her in the background. The deacon. There is obviously a connection between the deacon and these girls, but what? Maybe there's a connection, but I can't see it. I don't see what one has to do with the other. Okay, no, that's not. There is obviously a connection between the deacon and these girls, but what? I want to ask her more questions, actually. Let's talk to Yeah. I just want to try a few other things while I'm here. Hey there. Remember me? No. Maybe. Young lady, I hate to be the one to tell you this, but you're dead. It's so quiet. 
it... Sweetheart, are you listening to me? They all go away. The deacon made them go away. Listen, you don't have to worry about it anymore. Whatever it is, just let go. He haunts my dreams. He gets it in my head. He poisoned me. He's trying to kill me. But you're... Oh, forget it. Okay, so that's not gonna work. <laughs> um... Look, just... We'll cool. So that's not the way we approach <sighs> this. You all right? This is gonna take a long time to get used to. We got the rest of your life, doll. That's a long time. Um... Is there more back here? I guess not. I really don't see the I don't see the point in going to the hospital yet I know it's probably going to become relevant but I guess I'm back here so let's see if we we can get a hmm? little bit more detail Hi, out of it's me people. again creepy smile you have more questions yeah. yes I have I more questions what do you just want? let me get to it does the word deacon mean anything to you deacon no I'm afraid not cool well that's all thanks, thanks for, for not helping bye bye Kelly, I'm here to bother you again. Here I come. No, it's open. I'm gonna harass After you. you. Yeah. Hi, Kelly. Could I ask you some follow? <sighs> Make a quick. Uh. Deacon. Does the name Deacon mean anything to you? Nope. I'm agnostic. Well, shit. Do you know an Alexander Davenport? No. Thanks for helping. Yes. Yeah, All right. Thanks again. Whatever. Can't hear the problem here. What do you? Fuck. I wonder if this is Deacon. All right, I, I don't know where to go now, really. So I guess I'll go to, I guess I'll go to the hospital because that's really the only thing I can think of. I feel like I've exhausted the possibilities here and I've exhausted the possibilities in the park. Um, I don't know if like I fail if, or if I keep pushing the ghost or something. Man, I hate this place. I was stuck here for 25 years. Why'd you have to drag me back here, huh? Oh, damn. Sorry, man. I. Uh, I have to talk to the guard again, don't I? Hello, sir. I'm here to see Dr. Quentin. Sure thing, you're clear. Go right in. Cool. Thank you, sir. That was easy. No weird, uh, no weird. Come in. Series of events that needed to Dr. be Quentin? concluded. Oh, hello. Made to disappeared. Come in. Come in. Hello, Dr. Quinton. Um, Did my aunt and grandmother ever say anything specific about Joey? No. Why? Have you learned anything? Oh, no. I I was just wondering. Yes, oh, I have learned real something. Subtle. Real subtle. Uh, Do you know anything about headaches? It's hardly my specialty, but I know enough. Why? I've been getting them. I've been getting Lots headaches. In your case, I'd say they were triggered by stress. Are they usually this bad? It varies. Most things are triggered Over by the stress, counter, it pain seems. Medication, rest, that's all I'd suggest. Thanks. I'm gonna tell him about Joey! Dr. Quentin, I've got something to tell you. Hmm? Yes? It's about Joey. Oh. Oh no. Don't you dare. Yeah. Darling, you seem like a sweet kid. Don't ruin everything this early in the game. <laughs> I, um... Hey, whatever you think you're doing, stop right now. You say one word to this quack about me and the jig is up. He... Are you listening? I just spent 25 years in this dump. I'm not gassed up to do it again, you dig? You want to be locked up in a padded cell with me for company? Oh, shit. Because that's what'll happen. Oh. And I'll make sure your life is a living hell. Rude. Um, think about it. Yes, Miss Blackwell? 
Never mind. He's threatening Good me. Girl. Keep your yap shut and we'll get on just fine. That is so weird. Okay. B bye. I guess I'll Very well. Ah, uh, shit. Okay. There's probably some combination of notes that I haven't figured out yet then. Uh I don't think so. Just a small some kind of fuck. Okay. Um Hey Joey, can you uh locked. Whatever's back there, I can't get to it. Apparently that's Joey. <laughs> Apparently. Yes, Joey. Yes. What was it like staying here? Yeah, I want to know about that. Like, I was on a different floor, but it's all the same. Twenty-five friggin' years, hovering over your aunt's shoulder, staring. Oh, whoops! Sorry. Give me a second. Staring at the ceiling. You want to know how many cracks there were in that ceiling? Not really. Not really. Fifty-four, or maybe fifty-five. I was never sure about that last one. <laughs> I was never sure about that last one. How well did you know Dr. Quentin? That quack. He'd come into your aunt's room, poke her, prod her, try to get her to speak. He didn't know from nothing. I'd just as soon never see him again. Okay, so I guess he's not a professional. What was Auntie's condition like? She was a rotting vegetable, sweetheart. Damn! They kept her so drugged up that she could hardly move. Which is probably for the best, come to think of it. Without the drugs, she wasn't pretty. What the happened? Doc told you all about that. You don't need to hear it again from me. That's all for now. Right, right. What does that mean, though? Can I fuck with this? You need a key to open. Fuck. Okay. Can I... I guess I'll leave. I gotta go... I gotta figure something out. Um... Maybe I can do some research. Because I do have a computer. Maybe that's what I'm missing. I need to, like... I like the music in her apartment, too. Um, do research. On Deacon! See? That's too common a word. I knew- Whoever the Deacon is, I don't think I'll find him this way. Fuck. Okay, maybe not that. What about Allie? Allie Montego. Let's see if I can find her. Yeah, this is- mm. See? She apparently spent some time on a spiritual internet forum. She was looking for information about Ouija boards? Oh. Are Ouija boards dangerous? She yes. Asked. Can they call anything evil? Yes. And if so, how do you get rid of it? Depends on the kind of oh, evil. jeez. Another bunch of hacks messing with those stupid boards. This has happened before? A few times. Those things are nothing but trouble. True. Uh, how about Alexander Davenport? Hmm. And Alexander Davenport was listed as being on the hockey team at NYU. It doesn't say anything else about him, though. Susan Lee? Lee is a pretty common name, but it should narrow things down. I think I got her. Susan Lee, 18 years old, was admitted to Bellevue Hospital last week after an apparent suicide attempt. Oh! I think that's our girl. Oh! Okay! Okay! There are so many sites about this, and they all contradict each other. There's no way to really tell fact from fiction. Ask a witch. Okay. Um. With him staring over my sh- I can't. Okay, never mind. I'll just turn the computer off. All right, well, I want to connect a few things. Um. The girls were interested in Ouija boards, and they are all haunted by someone named the Deacon. Could there be a connection? There is obviously a connection between the Deacon and these girls, but what? Maybe there's a connection, but I can't see it. There is obviously a connection. Okay, well, we gotta go back to the hospital now. See, now there's a reason for me to go to the hospital. Yeah, sure. So, that's where we're headed. I just had to do some research, some old-fashioned research on the computer. Look at that. Well, shit. Flicker, flicker. Flicker, flicker. Um. Hello, Mr. Guard. Is Susan Lee a patient here? Susan? Yeah, we've got her. She came in about a week ago. May I visit Susan Lee? Sure. If you're on the approved guest list. Uh, what was your name again? Rosangela Blackwell. Oh, Sorry, you're Bruh. not on the list. She'll be out in a week. You can visit her then. 
I'd like to see. I'll some ask again. I told you, you're not on the guest list. Oh well, that's because. Uh, blame the system. Uh, Susan doesn't know me by that name. She calls me something totally different. Uh, yeah. Really? Well, what name would be on the list? I can't use that. That's a man's name. Alex? You could say Alex? Bruh, come on! That was- Come on! You could say Alex and he would be none the wiser. My name is Adrian. Sorry. No Adrian's on the guest oh. list. Damn it. Uh... I'd like to say- Oh, is that- Uh... Yeah. Susan doesn't- She- Really? Well, what name would- my name is Allie. Right. I don't think they'd let dead people on the- Sh good Shit. I'd like- I Oh, is that- Ah. Uh... Really? Well, what- That's not real. Uh... My name is Kelly. Nope. Shit. I'd like- I t Oh, is that- Well, I- Susan, she- Really? Well, what- Ah. Uh... My name is Joanne. Sorry, I don't think they'd let. But good try. <sighs> okay, so I don't have either of the names. Shit, man. Um. I'd like to. I oh, is that. I wasn't on the list at the time. I should be on it now. <coughs> oh, really? Well, let's check then. What was your name again? Ah. Uh... That's not. That's not. My name is Susan Lee. Your name is Susan Lee as well? Er... Uh, yes. yes. Right. What are you thinking? Help me! Come on! Thanks. Uh-huh. Fuck nuggets. Can I... Can I look at the phone book? I don't have any... Looks like an internal... Apparently, I want to talk... What do you want? That's all for now. Right. Oh, shit, that doesn't help. Um... Um. Ah, crap. Um. Whoa, hold on. You want to go? All right, all right, all right, all right. Uh, I can't really. Whoever Alexander Davenport is, Susan must like him a lot. He's either a boyfriend or something close to it. Is there a way I could go to the boys' dorm? Uh, fuck nuggets. Um. Brittany Hall dorm. The sign reads Sarah Kaplan and Julie Gilberg. The sign says Sandy Chen and. Adrian, can I talk to you again? <laughs> hmm? Hi, it's me again. You have more. Yeah, I yes. See. What do you want? Do you know anything about Ouija boards? Yeah. I'm afraid not. Do you know anything? I'm afraid not. She's... All right. Okay. Do you know... The name doesn't ring a... They really thought you were... Yeah. Did you ever meet... The name doesn't ring... Damn it! He doesn't know well, anything! For... Just rem... Kelly, I need you one more time. The sign said... No. The sign reads... I'm no. Next. All of these are girls, so that's not gonna be... The sign says, Shelly Shinoy and... Yeah, open. After you. There's gotta be. Yeah. Could I ask you? <sighs> Make it. I don't suppose not much. Quiet, I guess. Maybe she just didn't. I never stuck around. Much. Wait, why won't it let me? Do you know an Alexander Davenport? No. It won't let me. Thanks for helping. Yeah, sure. Please let me. It would really have helped you out enough. You can ask your stupid questions. But... Thanks again. Whatever. Can I use your phone again? It'll only take a second. I think you've used my phone enough. Why don't you get a cell? Damn it! <sighs> the safety bars on. 
the window has safety bars on it. I guess that's kind of ironic in a morbid kind of way. I recognize her. That's Joanne. I recognize the future Mrs. Davenport. I wonder what that means. That's her. She looks so. I wonder what. All right. I guess we gotta go talk to the ghost again, cause like I I can't get any more information out of those two. So that's not helpful. Just a bunch of notices. Nothing about the hockey team, which I think Davenport's on. No. Damn. This is one of those moments in a point and click game where it's like, what am I supposed to do? All right, let's let's give her a whirl. Hello, lady. Miss Allie Montego. Let's talk to that ghost again, Joey. Yeah, sure. Owie. Alpal. Hey there. Remember me? Hey, Alpal. Well, maybe. I like how, how our ghost is like kind of... Did you summon something with a Ouija board? Did I? That's why I'm asking you. I hate those things. I'll never use one again. And why is that? And why is that? Because... The Deacon Kid, did you get in contact with someone called the Deacon? The Deacon! I hate him so much. I knew it! Damn kids and your damn Ouija boards. Don't worry, we'll clean up this mess. Do you know anyone named Alexander Davenport? On a date with Alexander the Great. Was it an accident or was it just fate? Can you tell me? Little late won't say much. Hmm. Can you tell me? Alimentist. How about Adrian? Can you tell me? Kelly. Do you? Joanne. She's going to change the world. She's not dead. Even though she had to, they all had to go away because of the deacon. Look, just we'll figure. It mm, that's not helping me. She is so strange. Don't you think she's strange? Not really. I think she's a choice bit of calico myself. Maybe it's a ghost thing. What does that mean? I don't want to ruin the picture. Joey says that this girl looks exactly like the girl in the park. And according to Kelly, her name is Allie. According to Kelly, this girl on the left is Joanne. According to Kelly, this girl's name is Susan. Okay. Note, dog walk. Hmm. There is obviously. Allie was one of Joanne's friends, and just like Joanne, Allie is dead. I don't see what one ha Could Alexander Davenport have killed Allie? Whoever Alexander Davenport is, Susan must like him a lot. He's either a boyfriend or something close to it. Hmm. The school thought that Adrian was a girl because of his name. Alex could also be a girl's name. I wonder. Bruh, is that not what I was just saying like not too long ago? Oh my god, literally. Okay, well now I can use... I guess I just had to make the connection. But that's... <laughs> funny it's just I made the connection out of the game but I, I guess I had to literally make the connection in the game so now I can use that to go see Susan because obviously they're very close okay hey I'd like to I oh that's uh some Susan she really yeah well, what Alex my name is Alex Davenport huh your name is on the list can I go in now sure. literally I'll notify the I was like way ahead of the game She'll take you in Thanks. Cool. Let's go talk to Susie girl. Little Susie Walker. In a coma. Oh, geez. Alexander? Um, no. I'm sorry. Where's Alexander? Um. He's not here. They told me 
They told me he was coming. Yeah, I'm sorry, but I... It's okay. He doesn't want to see me anyway. Who are you? My name is Rosangela. I'd like to talk to you if that's okay. Are you a doctor? No. No, I'm not a doctor. But I'd still like to talk to you if that's okay. Mm-hmm. Um... So how are you feeling? Fine. That's all. Yeah, I'm fine. Whatever. Susan, can you tell me why you're here? What happened? Nothing. Just... nothing. Can you tell me anything about Alex? He... I don't know. He's nobody. Just some guy. Nuh-uh. -uh. No the fuck he is not. Do you know what happened to Allie? Yeah. Do you know why she did it? No. Do you know Joanne's roommate, Kelly? Yeah, sorta. Why? Oh, no reason. I'd like to talk to you about your friend Joanne. You know Joanne? Sort of. What, what about her? Can you tell me about her? She's Joanne. That's all. Do you know why Joanne killed herself? Susan? She just did. Don't know why. That's so- what? Susan, can you listen to me? You're not crazy. I know what happened. You summoned the deacon with a Ouija board. No, that didn't really happen. Susan, you don't have to pretend. I believe you. You do? Yes. Whatever happened, I believe you. He still comes to me. The drugs keep him away during the day, but when I sleep, he enters my head and he won't stop screaming. Ah. I thought I was crazy, but Joanne and Allie, how could it happen to all three of us? It's impossible. No, it's not. No, it's not. The deacon is real? Yes. I believe so, yes. Are you here to help me? Yes. I'm going to try. Thank God. I was ready to die here, but... I know. Can I ask you some questions about what happened? Sure. Ask whatever you want. Okay. So what happened to you, Tell Susan? me about you first. What did the deacon do to you? The same thing he did to the others. Got into my head and just wouldn't keep quiet. It was just so noisy inside my head. I had to do something. Jesus. I saw the speeding taxi, and I just... Well, you know, here I am. Were you hurt? No. The driver hit the brakes in time. The taxi missed me completely. Well, that's good. The stupid cop in the corner dragged me here. I can't even kill myself right. Damn. That's... wow. Oof. Can you tell me anything about Alex? Alex was my boyfriend, I guess. But since I came here, he won't see me anymore. Just as well. The jerk. Yeah, what an asshole. Can you tell me about Allie? Allie. Oh, I miss her so much. The sweetest, funniest person in the world. You couldn't help but smile with her around. She was always dragging us out on some adventure. She was so <laughs> different. Every other girl had pictures of boys on their walls. She had pictures of dogs. Aww. She loved dogs. She was Relatable. to be a vet to take care of them. Oh no, she can't. Oh no. She she was the first of us to go. Why is that? How come the strongest of us was the first to break down? I don't have the answer to that one. Was Kelly involved in any of this? Kelly? Joanne's roommate? Yeah. No. She always left when we came over. She didn't like us much. But that's okay. We didn't like her either. <laughs> yeah, well. Do you know why Joanne killed herself? Yes. The deacon. He got in our heads. His voice keeps pleading, babbling. Nothing shuts him up. Just keeps going. I just wanted quiet. Peace and quiet. That's why Joanne jumped off the roof. She was willing to give anything to just keep him quiet. Even her life. Damn, this man must talk a lot. Can you tell me anything <laughs> about Joanne? Joanne wanted to save the world, but she couldn't even save her friends. After
after Ali went, Joanne couldn't take it. She blames herself, but it's not her fault. I don't blame her for it. Any of it. It was only luck that I ended up here and didn't die. So Kelly has- No. We've already established this. I don't need to bring it up again. Okay. Can you tell me- Not really. Her door was always open. She had such a creative mind. She wrote poems about us. Silly, stupid things. Can you tell me again why Joe- For quiet. The deacon's voice inside her head. In the end, we'd give anything to silence it. Even our lives. That's so dark! Uh, Can you tell me anything about it? Nothing important. He's just some guy. He had a thing. It's done now. Can you tell me again? Same thing that happened to my friends. I tried to kill myself, but I didn't do it right. And now I'm here. Can you tell me anything else about Allie? No. Only that wherever she is, I hope there are dogs around. Oh. Can you tell me? No. I have to go now, but I'll come back to check on you again. Okay. Mm -hmm. Cool. Well, we got some information. I feel like maybe we can make some connections or go talk to Allie, the ghost again. Look, Joey, it's starting to get dark. Yeah, I can see that. Was it the darkness that gave it away? I'm just saying. Savage. <laughs> just a small... Uh, hmm. Judging from the photo, Kelly... Could Alexander... Whoever Alexander Davenport is, he's either... There is obviously a That makes no sense. Maybe there's a connection. I wonder if this... Joe, shh, you want to keep... Okay, I want to go talk to the ghost again, and if that's not what happens, I want to go see Kelly. Because I feel like she is not telling me the whole truth, the full truth, that I can't even go back there. Oh. I do not like that music. Let's talk to that ghost again, Joe. Spooky, Joey. spooky yeah, sure. music. Spooky, ooky music. Hey there. Remember? No. Um. Can you tell me anything? Did you summon something with? Did I? That's why I'm at. I hate on there. And why? Because uh, the deke. De I hate him. So I know. Damn. Don't uh, worry. Do you know when on a date with Alexander the Great? Was it an accident or was it just fate? Can you tell me? Kelly. Tell me. Beware, jo Wait. Tell me again about. Beware, Joanne, with her plans and brawls, for she intends to take over the world. Do you, Joanne? She's, she's even really they all because. Ah. Uh, Look, just we'll figure. Jesus, this is this hard. This place always looks like this just instead of a living person in there, there is a dead one. The sooner you think of us ghosts as normal, the better. Joe, shh. I want you to stop. Take a deep. Th there's no one here but the ghost, my man. Okay, this is getting this is getting tougher. Uh Combining clues. Oh, and the notebook. Okay. Allie was one and there is obviously. Mm -hmm. I wonder if this Alexander Davenport per that makes no sense. I don't see what one. I guess I have to go do some more research. I that's I don't know what else to do. I'll go back to my apartment. Wait. I could get the dog. Come in. 
I wonder if I could get. Wait. Be nice, Moti. She's our neighbor. Come in. Moti. Just one moment. <clears throat> boogity, boogity, boogity. <gasps> That's so mean. Don't do I'm that. I'm at a loss. He never acts like this. Never. It's all right. Don't worry about it. What is she doing? Uh, Could I feed Modi another treat? Sure. Here, take another. I have plenty. Well, I'd better take care, Rose. Come back whenever. You Come on, Moti. Can I lead you out of the apartment? See the look on that dumb mutt's face? So I mean. thought he was gonna wet himself. <laughs> You're an asshole. Come in. In and out and in and out. Hello again. Come in. Ooga. I don't this like that he's, that he's I, it's all right. All right, Nishanti, I need to talk to you. Well, take come back. Uh There's nothing to I hope. Go get it. See ya. I feel like this might be relevant later, but not now. I wish you would come with me, but I guess I can't really take the dog with me. Do you have to keep doing that to Modi? Yeah! Are you going soft for that barking rat? Well, it's just not nice. It's not we nice. I take my kicks where I can get them. Don't ruin my fun. What a jerk. All right, let's do some more research, I guess. I already look. Uh, I already. Susan Lee. Hmm. And Alexander Davenport was listed as being on the hockey team at NYU. It doesn't say anything else about him, though. That's too common a word. Whoever the deacon is, I don't think I'll find him this way. No. No information about Kelly. My article hasn't been published yet. Typical. No. I can't find any information about Joanne. With him, I can't. Joey? What do you want? Um. I don't suppose you'd know anything about Joanne, would you? Nope, no more than you. Judging by the picture, she knows that sob story in the park. Well, that's all. So the ghost's name is Allie. Looks like it. And she's trapped in the dog run at Washington Square Park. That's where she is. And we have to save her. Yep. Is this going to be a typical day from now on? You'll look back on this as one of the normal ones. I don't suppose you'd know anything about Susan? Nope, no more than you. Who do you think Alexander is? Well, judging from that silly doodle you're carrying around, I'd say he was Susan's boyfriend. You think he's involved? Anything's possible. Any idea who the deacon might be? No idea. Although, he must be a pretty formidable fellow, considering what's been going on. What do you think of Kelly? A kid? I suppose, once you get past all that metal, and the clothes, and the hair, and the nasty makeup, not to mention the skin, and the nasty He's attitude... super judgy. Maybe. Nah, forget it. Why would Joanne commit suicide? Who knows? Maybe she was in a hurry. That's not funny. If you want a different answer, ask a different ghost. I think I've heard enough. Yeah, let's get... Uh, I'm not ready for... Damn it. I suppose I should... I don't need to bother. It's a photograph of Auntie Lauren and me. And Joey, too, I guess. I don't need to touch it. 
There's nothing in the cook. Why bother? No, I opened those curtains. I'm not up for what. I don't need to take the track. They're fine where they are. Just some old. <sighs> I gotta figure something out though. You coming? Yeah. So. I can't remember. I'm not knocking on. I can't go to the. Locked. What? Maybe I'll talk to Susan again? I'm not stealing stuff. I'd like to. Sure thing. Go right in. Okay, so I, I'm gonna go visit Susan again. Hi, Susan. Hi. It's good to see you again. How are you now, Susan? Better. It's nice to know I'm not crazy. Yeah, that's a good feeling. It's just... these drugs. The meds help keep the deacon's voice low, and that's good. But they also cause water retention, and I have to take a diuretic pill to fix that. And I'm just sick of peeing all the time. <laughs> now that I know I'm just haunted and not really crazy, I don't see why I have to take it. I don't care if I retain water and get fat. I just want to stop peeing. <laughs> Is she for real? That's so I've been palming the pills. Is that bad? I can't answer that. Well, <laughs> I was hoping you could do me a favor. What? Can you take the pills out of here? I'm scared the orderly will find them. Please. Fine, uh, give them to me. You are such a chump. Thanks so much. Uh We've already a Can you tell me No. Can you tell same thing that I try now? Can you tell nothing important? He had a thing. So Kelly, no. So Kelly, no. What else can nothing really? Can you for quiet? The deacon. So I, I have to go, but I'll come. I can't get any new information, but I did get a new item, so maybe I could do something with that. Uh. Oh, I bet. I think I know what I have to do. Did Joey just like make the radio fizzle? That's weird. Okay, I think I have to, I think I have to give. These pills, according to Susan, are a mild diuretic. Okay. Come in. I think I have to give the diuretic to. Welcome back. Come in. To Mati. <laughs> so mean. All right, Nishanti, can I have? Could I feed Modi another treat? Sure. Here, take another. I have plenty. Well, I take care. Come back. When That's Nishanti. Um. Go get it. Uh, See ya. Shit. These pills. These pills, according to Susan, are a mild diuretic. How do I grab something? Help. Uh, using my inventory. Examine items combined. Oh, drag. Left click on one item and drag the item onto. I'm an idiot. These pills. Okay. Looks like it looks a little. Mm 
No, that's not. Damn it. Okay. Interacting with objects. Interact. Okay. Using your inventory. Examine inventory. Right clicking. Combine inventory. Left click on one item. Then drag. Another tree. I think I know now. I know how to do it now. Could I be sure? Well, they come back. Okay. Okay. Now that the diuretic is on the dog biscuit, I give. I where did Joey go? Did he wait outside? Come here, boy. Go get it. Uh oh. Now he's gonna scratch the door because he gotta go outside. Oh, Moti, now? I just took you out an hour ago. Well, you're going to have to wait. I have my hands totally full. Unless. Rosa, would you mind taking Moti for a walk? If you're I going can do to it. Friends, this is a good opportunity for you to bond. Oh, sure. I don't mind at all. Thank you so much. Moti gets cranky when he doesn't get his way. Just take him to the park until he goes. It shouldn't take long. Okay, so now we can take him to go see Allie, and Allie likes dogs, right. so this is gonna help there her with go, her boy. identity, and this is gonna help save her. Yay! We're doing it. We're doing the point and click thing. Oh, there's Joey. You're drugging innocent dogs now. It's only a mild diuretic. It won't hurt him. I also don't like. And you're the one in such a damn hurry. All right. Point taken. Oh, I hate that music. <laughs> Hey there, bright eyes. It's me again. Are... are you him? No, I'm not, but I've brought some friends. Say hi to the kids, sweetheart. Um, hi. I don't think she wants to see me. Sure she does. <laughs> Go on, kid. Tell Ellie how much you want to see her. Oh, uh, yeah, sure. Great to meet you. See? I don't believe you. It doesn't matter if you believe me or <laughs> not. She needs your help. Help? See the dog over there? The Boston Terrier? Good, good. You know your breeds. And he's a cutie this pie. This Boston Terrier is not feeling too well. I was hoping that you could take a look at him. Uh, yes. Yes, I can. I know a lot about dogs. So we heard. Yay! That's why we came to you. But they won't let me help them. They always run away. Aw. This one won't. Go on. The dog needs you. So this is your dog, huh? Um, yeah, sort of. Hi, little guy. What's your name? <laughs> right. Aren't you the cutest little thing? Hmm. Your ears look okay. No signs of inflammation. Now I'm just going to open your mouth. That's odd. I don't feel any breath. I don't feel anything. Oh. Oh. I'm sorry. I remember. I'm dead. Yep. Yep. I killed myself. I had no choice. Can you tell us what happened? Oh, that's, that's so, so dark. Right. We played a game. A Ouija board. We thought it would be fun. And you called something. Yes. He called himself the deacon. It's kind of hazy now, but I remember his voice in my head, screaming. What did he say? I don't know. It didn't make any sense. He just kept asking me to help him, but he wouldn't say how. I tried ignoring him, but he just got louder and louder until I took the pills and- Shh. It's over now. I know. So what now? Now? Now, we're going to send you where you need to go. Here. Magic tie! And hold on tight. I can you show ready? you the world. Uh, I guess so. 
good. Shining, yeah, shimmering, splendid. Oh, God. Yeah, you and me both. Ow. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> Did we do it? Hello. Yeah, hi. I'm not sure if we've met. I'm Rosangela. I know, you brought the dog to me. You brought me back to my senses. And then you brought me here. Thanks so much. So are you ready to, well, you know. Am I ready to die? Well, yeah. Sorry, I'm kind of new at this. <laughs> That's okay. I'm going to make it easy for you. Just tell me what to do. Just head towards that light. The light. Right. It's like every cliche in the book. <laughs> Hello, Medna. You think I'll see Joanna over there? I'm sure you'll find whatever it is you want to find. Yeah, I suppose you're right. And hey, you'll make sure Susan's okay, right? Sure. Well, here goes. See ya. Yay, we did it! See ya. That's really sad that Ugh. she killed herself because You're a awake? ghost got, you know, that didn't take too, long. too much. She just went. She, she just seemed went? happy about it. Yeah, sometimes you'll get easy ones. The ones who are all too happy to move on. Others, well, you'll see. Anyway, let's get this dog back before your neighbor calls the police. Our work is not over yet. Yeah, I still have a lot of questions about like all these different names she that I have. She is so in my going notebook. to kill me. And just a minute. Oh, oh, there you are. I was just about to go to bed. I'm sorry we took so long. Not to worry. Did you have fun, Moti? Did you have fun? Of course. Aw. Well, good night, Rosa. Thanks again for helping me out. She's a very nice lady. I like her. Strange lady. Strange? She's nice. Let's go to bed. <laughs> With him staring over my shoulder? I can't. Uh, can I do... Okay, I guess I can't really... I'm not ready. That leads. It's an overs. I really? I can't. Can I go somewhere else now? You can. How strange. So, okay. So, Ali moved on. I guess we're going to go talk to Susan again? Please. Oh. No can do, Toots. Remember what she said? The deacon comes to her at night when she's sleeping. Waiting until tomorrow won't do us any good. What? You think we can just waltz right into Susan's room? Sure. How? Improvise, sweetheart. That's what this gig is all about. Okay. I guess we are breaking into this poor girl's hospital room. I need to speak to Susan Lee. Can I see her? Visiting hours are over, miss. She's probably sleeping by now. About Susan Lee. I visiting. Come back. Seduce the guard. Uh, you're kind of cute. I'm flattered, miss, but I'm gay. Oh, I'm oh. sorry. <laughs> Swerve. <laughs> oh, that. Wow, that backfired. <laughs> About Su I visiting. Come back. To <laughs> I'm flattered, but I'm gay. <laughs> it will only take a few minutes. Sorry, miss. Rules are rules. Rules Nobody is rules. Nobody gets in past visiting hours. Nobody. Nobody talks to the wizard. Nobody not know how. About Su I uh, visit, come back. Can I beg him? Please, can't I go past? Oh, jeez. I told you. Vis About I visiting, come back. Can I threaten look, him? You'd better look. Or what? You'll keep glaring at me? Forget it, miss. Uh, Don't threaten me again or I'll have you escorted out. Yes, sir. Is Doc He's long gone, miss. You can catch him tomorrow. About Susan Lee. Mm, so I guess I the roundabout you. way is not gonna work Visiting either. Now is over. Come back tomorrow. 
Hey, what's that behind you? Just the duty roster. I'm on double shifts this week. Oh, never mind. Thanks. Oh, I don't goodness. think I need any of these other keys. Some small key. One of them is labeled just a small transistor radio. I don't think so. Some small key. One of them is labeled fuse box key. I could probably do something with this. Joey. Jo Shh, keep okay, fine. We'll go out in the other room. Joey, I need you to fuck with his radio. Come here. I know. I saw that. I saw. I saw what you. I was picking Joey? up. Joey. Yeah. What happened with that radio? Yeah. What do you mean? When you got near the radio, the signal got interrupted. Was that you? Yeah. How do you do it? No idea. Although your aunt never let me get near the TV during days of our lives. I'm <laughs> sure there's some scientific explanation, but I have no way of knowing, and frankly, who the heck would we ask? That's all for now. Right, right. I don't have anyone. Apparently, hey, Joey. What is it? That's all. Right. Joey, uh, can you fuck with the fuse box? Oh, I took the key. When did I get the key? Now you've done it. You better find a place to hide quick. Whoa, you startled me. You better leave. I can't be held live. I'll get the elevator. Oh, shit. No, wait. I, I fucked up. Um... Hold on, I want to hide in that little nook there. Looks like a fuse. Don't I hope you better find a place. I do what I want! I did it! <laughs> She's asleep. Yeah, like a baby. It won't be long. Before what? <gasps> Before that. Uh-oh. Please. Please. Can't you help me? Please. I don't know what to do. I don't want to burn. Please. The others are gone. You're the only one. Please. You can't hear me here, but you can hear me in your dreams. Please. Wake up and help me. Don't shut up. Hey. Ignore them, Susan. Listen to me. Help me. Please. Dude! I'm talking to you, clown shoes. <laughs> you're... You're talking to me? Clown shoes? How do you know he's not yeah, wearing any? So, can you calm down long enough to tell me what's going on? Can I you leave these poor ladies alone? Can't. You're like me. What do you mean? Dead. Like, like me. Yes. Wait a minute. Just a goddamn minute. You know you're dead? Yes. yes. Well, that certainly saves time. We can help you. Here, grab a hold of this. No. no. Get that away no. from me. What the hell is wrong with you? Yeah. You need saving. We're here to save you. What's the problem? I can't. What are you so scared of? You're stuck, right? We can help you move on. No. I don't want to. You don't want to? So you just want to... S I'm afraid. Oh, you're afraid, are you? You believe this guy? What do you want? Safety. Sanctuary. It's following. Waiting. Watching. Trying to take me. But it hasn't caught me yet. Not yet. Yeah, whatever. Dude, put this the guy's flask off down. his nut. 
Let me handle this baby doll. I know how to speak to spooks like this. Okay, Joey, I'll let sure. you take over. Do it your way. All right, Mac. Spill. You've scared these girls literally to death, and I want to know why. What are you so afraid of? I... I don't want to burn. Like in hell? Burn? Oh, oh, I get it. You think you're going to hell. It's the devil himself. He told me. Please don't make me go. You're scared of the devil, huh? Yes! Yeah, well, I don't see any devil. There's just you and me. And you know what? I'm worse than any devil you'll ever see. What the fuck? Hey. He's gonna I've been doing this for 40 years, bucko. Every ghost I meet goes to their final rest one way or the other. You're scared? I don't give a rat's ass. Two people are dead because of you. So take the damn tie and let's get this over with. No. You can't make me. Good cop, bad cop, don't I suppose. Make me burn, please. <sighs> Hurts, don't it? Oh. Ghosts aren't supposed to feel pain, but I've learned some tricks. Now take the damn tie. Joey, stop it. Give, give, give her you a chance. You want to handle this? Go right ahead. Let's see you do any better. I know a safe place. You can hide there. Really? Where is it? Not far, but you'll have to trust us. Trust you? Why should I trust you? Uh... You can't keep going on like this. It's better than burning. Uh-huh, yeah, you had your shot. Now it's my turn. Ah, shit. No, he's gonna so, punch him. Are we gonna do this the easy oh, way? Oh, God, we're good cop, bad copping this way. ghost. Please. No. What are you gonna do to me? Please don't make it get me. I don't want to go to hell. <laughs> hell, Schmel. You want to stop talking crap? Hey, stop. Let me talk to him, okay? You want to handle this? Go. Let's see. Uh... You killed two people. Almost killed a third. Doesn't that mean anything to you? They called me. Why would they call me if they couldn't help me? Yeah, that didn't work. I'm taking over. No, Joey, I don't want I don't you to take I believe in a... hell, buddy. But you have two choices. Oh, Jesus. The slight possibility of an eternal torture in hell or the dead certainty of an eternal torture by me. But you can't. Sure I can. You gonna stop me? Make your choice. I... Wrong answer. You're hurting him, Joey. Yeah, that's the idea. You got any better ones? Let me talk. Yes. You wanna? I do wanna All handle right, this. See. Oh my God. Um. Because nobody else has offered to help you before, right? Yeah. You ask and ask for help, but nobody answers, right? No. Nobody answers. Well, we have. We're gonna help you. Has anybody else said the same? No. No, they haven't. I think... Oh, I'm so tired of running. So this is seeming to work. If you say you can help me, I believe you. Okay. What needs to be done? Just listen to my friend. Take the tie. No, just take the tie. You know what to do. I can't believe she pulled that off. Yeah! I didn't have to punch him! I got an achievement Ow. for that. You were right. I feel safe. Are you ready? Yes. I really think so. It's really nice out here. Almost like. I have found you. Excuse me? No, you lied to me. What? It's here. You lied. What's that? Oh, crap. Oh, Joey? crap. Joey, get me out of here. 
Stay away. Stay away! There is nowhere to go. What the fuck? You cannot return to the mortal This is Satan! <laughs> you can only go through me. Accept the punishments for your sins and come with me. This is what? Help me. Please. You brought me here. You have to save me. You have to. Fool. No one can save you. I'll give you a moment to prepare for the eternity to come, but then you are mine. Ah! Uh... What is that thing? It's come to take me to hell, just like it always said it would. Uh, excuse me. Yeah, excuse Converse me, Mr. With me not. I shall give him time to prepare himself for the eternity to come. But then he is mine. I don't like this. Um How did you get here? What is here? It is but an abstract concept to one such as I. I move at the power of thought. At the speed of death. Once my business is concluded, I shall trouble you no more. Why are you after this man? For his sins. All this time, he has not renounced them. Even after these many years of death, he still carries them with him. Can't you just let him go? He has killed many with his madness. His sins weigh him down even as we speak. Ask yourself, does he deserve mercy? Yes. Yes. You may think so, but your heart does not believe it. You have witnessed the results of his actions with your own eyes. Uh... Hello, um, hmm. What is that in your pocket? My flask. Yeah, what's in it? Nothing. It's just a force of habit, I guess. Used to keep whiskey in it when I was alive. So what can I do? What does he want? He wants me. I don't know why. <sighs> what is that thing? I... Don't know. <laughs> it haunted my dreams when I was alive and wouldn't leave me alone after death. And now there's no place left to run. What is that in your pocket? My flask. Yeah, what? Nothing. It's just a. used to keep. Uh, Convert. I shall. Uh. The deacon is carrying his sins, and the deacon is carrying his flask. Could this be symbolic? symbolic? Get rid of that flask. Huh? Your flask, get rid of it. My flask? Why? Just do it. But, but I can't. Why not? Because it, it's my flask. You want to be free of that demon? Trust me. Yeah, do you want the flask or do you want the demon? It, it comes down to that. You no longer carry your sins with you, dead one. But they still taint this place. That is not enough to save you. There's nothing really special about it. It's kind of vibrating. Beware, mortal. The sins this man carried with him are still tainting this place. Touch them and they will taint you as well. I am content with taking my quarry, but I have no claim on you. Take this man's sins upon yourself, and I shall be forced to take you as well. You do not want that, and neither do I. Mr. Demon. Converse. I sh but Can't you just... He has killed his s ass. Yes. yes. You, may you have witnessed. What is that? My yeah. Nothing. Uh. 
It's just a used to keep whisk. Please. There's nothing really. It's. Beware of the stuck I am taking you do. Ah. Uh, um. Can I spot? I wanna. Uh. Oh, the cobblestone. Smash the flask. It is done. The sins have been abolished. I did it. I didn't know I could pick up that cobblestone. And my claim on you, dead one, is gone. Move on in peace and be troubled no more. The fuck was I that? Think so. He's gone. I'm, I'm free of him. I'm really free. All this time, it's all so clear to me now. Like my head was full of cobwebs and now they're gone. I... All those people who died, they killed themselves because of me. And what do you think about that? I didn't know what I was doing, but that doesn't excuse it. I spent most of my life as a drunk, and most of my death as a murderer. I was worried about going to hell before. Maybe I'm okay with that now, now that I know I might deserve it. Maybe there isn't a hell. It's too late for that. You see, I was a religious man once, before disease took my wife away, and I took to the bottle. If I'm going to hell, well then maybe I can still spread the word of God there. Do some good for once. Well, this is it. Goodbye. And thanks. Man, that was fucking deep. That was deep. Also, did not expect to see like full on fucking demon creatures. Jesus did not, Christ, kid. did not know what? that that was what yeah. I signed up for. Yeah, I mean, I'm fine. What took you so long? Not the worst thing I've ever gotten myself into, but... a little but... complicated. Well, I'm just glad you're okay. Let's get out of here. I need some air. I know the perfect place. Jeez, that... Wow. He's at peace now, I guess. Wherever he is. I saved him, I think. Gave him some hope, at least. He's getting no more than he deserves. No more than any of us deserve. I guess. I really wished I could have popped him one more time. He really hacked me off. Is that your answer to everything? Yeah, what the Don't heck? Don't you start judging me. You managed to pull it off. I'm impressed. Just glad you're okay. Joey? Yeah? Why did Auntie stop? Stop what? Stop doing this. This ghost saving or whatever it is we do. Oh. Uh, it was you. Me? She wanted to take care of you. Wanted to do it right, she said. Stop listening to me. Stop saving the ghosts. Just put all her effort into taking care of you. And then she fell into that weird coma. Yeah. Hmm. I see. I guess there's a lesson in that. Is there? Why did the music stop? Yeah. Medium well done. Oh, that was it. Oh, wait, that was that's it. Oh, okay. Okay, then. That was nice and short, short, and sweet. I liked it, and there's a whole series of them, so. Wow! I. I thought that'd be longer! <laughs> wow, okay! I did not expect to finish that today. Nice! Okay then! Ooh. Rebecca Whitaker, good job. Excellent voice work. Love your hair, by the way. Abe Goldfarb, 
did a good job, Joey Malone. I liked it. I liked it. Uh, Ali and Kelly. I like Kelly a lot. I'm not gonna lie. Um, Jennifer Asteris. Good job, Susan Lee. Okay. Thomas Tucker. Adrian. Adrian Tucker. Nice name. Share last name. I liked Nishanti. Joe Rodriguez is Dr. Quentin. <laughs> I'm flattered, but I'm gay. <laughs> oh, the deacon. Oh, this little shitbird. I forgot about him. Locking me out of my apartment in the beginning. The demon. Wow, I really did not expect to finish this game. So, who was Bob again? I can't remember who Bob was. Coffee, lots of it. Relatable. Bright eyes. Special activation code. Okay. Bright eyes. I think there's like a way to enter. There's hundreds of confused spirits out there, sweetheart. And there's nobody else who can help them. There's just us. Bestowing eternity on every sob story out there. One lost soul at a time. Whether we want to or not. Interesting. Wait, oh, it closed. Oh, it closed my game. Wait, open that bad boy back up. Wait a minute. We got a special code to enter. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. We're not done yet. We're not. This isn't over yet. This isn't over yet. We're not done. Uh, <laughs> I want to enter that special code. Open it back up. Come on. You can do it. What a, what a cute little indie game. Okay. I want to see... Options. Special. Oh! Bright eyes? <laughs> Bloopers! La la la. I'm Joey. I'm such a ghost. It's really incredible exactly how much of a ghost I am. Sorry, there are no Joannes on the guest list. Excuse me. <laughs> I was, uh, having some, uh, pasta for lunch here, and, uh, yeah. <laughs> Please, can't I go past? Please. Please, can't I go past? Oh. <laughs> That's a little voice. That's her uwu voice. Rosa's uwu voice. A box of biscuits, a box of mixed biscuits. Here, don't do that. And a biscuit mixer. I stood on the steps of Burgess's fish shop. Inexplicably walked in and out. You're supposed to do that before you do it. You know, it's your blah, blah, blah. Oh, that's your, your warm up. Warm up. A box of mixed biscuits. All right. <laughs> Although your aunt threw a fit. Ah! <laughs> Although your aunt. N uh, one, two, three. Silence. I don't need to touch it. I know these plants are fake. They're fine where they are. I love that all of these are just indicating stop touching that. <laughs> stop clicking on that. Yeah. Nobody gets pet. <laughs> I need to breathe more. <laughs> Where are my levels, my levels, my levels? <laughs> <laughs> These are delightful. Okay. My name is Abe Goldfarb. Uh, I'm a professional actor. <laughs> actually, this, I, I'm enjoying, I'm getting paid a lot. Um, I actually get, I get $30 a word uh, more if the word is saucy. Oh. And there is some saucy verbiage in this. Let me, this is as loud as I'm going to talk. 
This is as loud as I'm going to talk. <laughs> man, oh, man. These tests. It's pure, pure gold. Pat, no, uh, I had a teddy bear. Huh. Well, you probably had the right idea. Uh, That's a little, that was too heightened, I think. Let me do it again. Yeah. When you do this, could you actually laugh at it? Which like, one? Ah. Like a teddy bear. Oh, 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 yeah. oh, okay. Do you actually think it's funny? Ah. Uh. Like, ha. Ah. <laughs> 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 All right. <laughs> I love it when voice actors just like shoot Making the shit. Making fluff all over the place. All right, where am I? Um, I live here. <laughs> no, you don't. What do you care? I can't let you in unless you tell me. I know everybody in the building, and I don't know you. <laughs> the evil demon gets a bit confused. Do, do, do. Demon, demon. I've lost my place on the script. Hold on. Getting to it. Crap. Oh my gosh. Nishanti oh, Stark's dude. secret. Oh, whoops. Oh, what if? Mm -hmm. I think she's a dyke. <laughs> she's attracted to Rosa. <laughs> Feeling it. It's my motivation. <laughs> That's your motivation? <laughs> no. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Oh, I'm kidding. <laughs> it's something. She's a predatory uh, <laughs> sex fiend. <laughs> It's not something I was considering. But you never know, right? Ghost schmoes, get over here. Oh, uh, um, um, wow. It's no, like it's not. Really disturbed. <laughs> Don't feel disturbed. <laughs> All right, next. Hovering over your aunt's shoulder. Oh, God. <laughs> staring at the seal. All right, let's try that one again, motherfucker. Because <laughs> that well, was fucking perfect. Yeah. Okay. He went like right full on. Jack Black there. <laughs> I sang every line as a black lady gospel singer, which inside is kind of what I am. All right, <clears throat> let's try it again. You're a very right. white man, sir. <laughs> Take two. Yeah, gave the wrong name. Sorry. <laughs> well, way to pull that one out of your ass. <laughs> Almost started laughing. Moti is getting a little cranky anyway. Let's get you home. Thanks. Did you see the look on that dumb mutt's face? <laughs> Thought he was gonna wet himself. <laughs> Joey Snickers. <laughs> that is a great little snicker. I yeah. love that. All right, do it again. That's for, for Joey. <laughs> Now that Dave Gilbert has finished his phone call, yeah, we can continue sure. making the game. <laughs> <laughs> yes. These are good. These are very good. That's super cool that they added like little secrets in there. Wow, though. I I did not. Wow. Okay. So I guess that was that was the end. That was the end of the Blackwell legacy. Um what is the next one in the, in the Blackwell Ghost series? Uh, oh, that's a, wait, that's an actual, what? Creepy. The Blackwell Game series. <laughs> uh, okay, so I guess Blackwell series, um, I guess the second one is Blackwell Unbound. Wow, it was released almost on Christmas in 2006. Huh. Okay. I, I guess Blackwell Unbound will be the next one that I, uh, that I play. I guess I'll I'll uh, I'll go ahead and start downloading that, um, and that way I'll have it ready for uh, the next time. But wow, yeah, that was really fun. I liked uh, I liked how that worked. Um, I got a little I got a little turned around, a little confused there at the end, um, but that's like bound to happen because <clears throat> that's bound to happen during a point and click game. Just how it goes. Open up Steam. <clears throat> I got a black Blackwell Blackwell. Where it is, Blackwell. Bla oh, fuck. 
<laughs> Go to my library, please. Blackwell Unbound. Um, yes. Go ahead and install that bad boy. Finish. Wow. Uh, if they're all this short, um, I might be able to knock these out really quickly. And we could do, like, multiple games a stream or... Just, you know, one game, is, that might, like, little one-offs, that might be, that might be kind of fun. But anyway, thank you guys for joining me on this little ghost mystery adventure. I'm glad we could uh, help some poor spirits cross over into the next world. Uh, we're, we're doing, we're doing good work. Um, I'm going to be streaming again on Wednesday. This week I am not doing art. Um, I'll be working on art in my, uh, kind of in my free time rather than uh, live on stream. Um, I wanted to uh, I wanted to play some more games this week. I just wanted to chill this week. So, so uh, yeah, I'll be playing some Ace Attorney on Wednesday. It's uh, trying to get back to it before all of my friends can play the great Ace Attorney before me. Uh, I'm super behind already, but we're working through it. Um, we're making our way through Ace Attorney Investigations too, and I think I'm over halfway done with that one. So we will get back to that mystery. And uh, this is just a mystery week. It's just mystery week because Steins Gate's on Friday. So, yeah, see me, catch me on Wednesday, 7 p.m. EST. Um, if you haven't already, give me a follow here. You'll get notified every single time I go live. Um, and you can follow me on all of the social medias, uh, Instagram, Twitter, TikTok, YouTube. Um, I'm everywhere. YouTube is like my running archive. TikTok, I do fun videos and shit posts and cosplay mostly uh that's where my cosplay lives um twitter is really where i hang out a lot see you see I may, any updates i may have and instagram is where i post that sweet sweet art that i do usually on wednesdays um we also have a discord if you use the command exclamation point discord you can join up the discord um it's not super hopping in there right now but like you know we can make it that way it's always a party if you make it a party um, but yeah, I hope everybody has a good rest of their day slash night, depending on what time zone you're in. Um, and you know what? I haven't said this in a while, and it's time I start saying it again. Hydrate yourself and get some rest because you deserve it. I will see you guys next time. Bye. <laughs>